This is the property on West Tallow. It's five acres. Um, fairly steep, but it goes down to Wolf Creek, which, and Brewer, Brewer Road is the road over there if you, um, well, as I say, I thought that car I heard was over there, but it's here. Um, this is uh, Wolf Creek Road up here. Um, Oaks, house out front, nice two-car. Oversized two-car garage, propane tank down here, cement retaining wall. The deck could have a few issues with, well, one post on the deck and underneath the house, which doesn't appear to be as extensive as what they're calling for to repair it at $25,000. Um, Probably just go through the front door first, which is on the side here. There's a privacy fence up here. Another retaining wall here. And then the outside is facing Wolf Creek Road. And there's a couple skylights here. The whole house inside has these wood shutters. Pretty sure this is hardy board. The living area here, hardwood floor, that's a, a gas heater, which is operated with a control on the, we usually have a handheld control, but there's one on the wall here. Um, little archway here coming in. So the living area isn't exactly huge. I think this might be slate on the floor here coming into the eating area and the kitchen, which is uh, you know, probably adequate, it's not huge. Cabinets are nice. Refrigerator, I think, stays, which is a newer LG. Has double sinks. Area here is the um, well, I'll just pull right over here. This is okay. This area is the laundry room with the slate, washer and dryer hookup cabinet. There's not a sink. This is a storage for either I could use it for a pantry or for. Uh, laundry things as a central vacuum system out here in the garage which is we call it an oversized two-car garage it's all it's sheet rocked probably insulated that does have this storage going around the top of it And off the kitchen in this area, there is a bedroom over here. So right now the mother, I think, is living here and the daughter and her family have moved. So not a big room, but it's a bedroom with a closet over here. And the deck, of course, is out here. So before I do the rest of the house, maybe I'll just swing out here in the deck. Which they're saying here there needs to be a post, which I think we found replaced. And there's supposed to be a few deck boards and it needs to be repainted. Actually, it doesn't look that bad. I know the fellow quoted like five grand to do that, which seems extremely high, which only tended to make me think the bid he had for the work under the house was big too. Built in 2003, so the air conditioning, which is a heat pump, heat and air, is um, 14 years old, as would be the roof. Wolf Creek is down at the bottom of the five acres here.
Yeah, it has kind of a nice local view. It has an awning out here, which I'm pretty sure it's power because it's plugged in. The roof says it's 14, so it's it's definitely got another say 15 years anyway left in it. And on this side, yeah, you can see where he probably pointed out a few boards, but it seems pretty solid. There's some stairs going down on the side yard, which this whole side yard with the fence up there and with the fence going around it here is fenced. The gate. I'm not sure what that is up there. I think it might be a chicken hutch or for chickens, yeah. Well, not, I was going to go into the bedroom that way, but I don't want to make it confusing. So here's the kitchen. A couple areas here for Here's a half bath here. And this would be deemed a master bedroom. It's a vaulted ceiling. Fan. Has the double vanity sinks. Same type of cabinetry. Is a nice size, you know, walk in closet. Shelving on this side. And then the, this area is missing a few lights that are up. Toilet here, the walk in shower. And the, uh, Soaking tub. Actually, it's a spa. It's got jets in it. But unfortunately, the light up here is out. So you got the little bedroom down there at the end, the master here. And then you go up the stairs here, and there's two large bedrooms. Stairs are a little steep. And like Cheryl pointed out, they're not maybe as wide as they should be for fitting your foot on them. And the little platform area up here has a whole house span, attic area, an area here for linens or whatever. The bath here, again, it has two basins. Tub over shower. This tile. Toilet. And uh, window here. And the bedrooms. I think they're both about the same size of vaulted ceilings. Closet. Fan, cables up here for TV, and the other bedroom would be same size, same layout, with the closet over here. And back downstairs. Look, I shall end it here in the kitchen.